Hello and welcome to the first part of the uh, beginners tutorials for the Hammer Editor. Uh, you've come to the right place if you want to learn the basics on how to create a room or just laugh at my uh, accent or watch me make mistakes when I'm trying to talk to you. Um, the first thing we're going to do is we're just going to show you how to create the basic room in this part. So as you can see I've got the Hammer Editor open now. The first thing you'll do is go to File and New you can see straight away that we've had our uh, first map pop up we've got our grid views at the top here the side and front and our camera view the things we're going to be looking at really on this tutorial is the sidebar here these big fancy colourful buttons and also the texture browser over on the right so what I'm going to do is just show you how to choose a texture first of all just click browse see a few of the brick textures pop up you can filter what we want to look for down here so we're going to type in DEV that should bring up the development textures and what you're going to need is just this grey one here for the floor ok so once you've done that just double click that to make sure you get that texture go over to the block tool click on that and what you're going to do now is you're going to drag out by holding your left mouse button down drag like that it just creates our uh, outline of the brush we're about to make so one thing I'll also bring your attention to is the uh, snap on grid which you can see down here 64 it's at the moment, This that's basically how detailed the grid is so we're using our left and right square brackets on the keyboard you can increase that or lower that as you can see lower for more detailed brushes so we'll leave it at uh, 32 for now and I've made the brush 512 and in the side views you can zoom in using your mouse wheel if you hold down control as well you can zoom in all the views so just bring that down to 32 press enter and that creates a solid brush now if we want to have a look at that the first thing we should do is just click over on the camera tool hold down shift make a camera then using the left and right mouse you can look around in that view really easy you can also make multiple cameras by using the shift and dragging some more and then if you uh, just set those up, you can use page up and page down to go between those which is handy if you've got a really big map so I'll use this one for now once you've created that brush just click off of it just press escape I'm going to make some walls now so the same process as before, just drag just down like that and bring this up so it's level with the floor bring that up to 128 units high which is the standard height for all the Half-Life 2 textures press enter again and we've made our first wall and there's a really quick and easy way to finish off the other walls which is why that's still selected just hold down shift and drag that over and that clones it for you just pop that the other side do that again click on it once you get the rotation handles so just drag that around follow the same process to make the other three walls, there we go so we've got our walls made there as you guessed we're going to do the same on the floor bring that up for the ceiling so there we go, there's our basic room made at the moment in the next tutorial we're just going to go over texture in that for you and see how you can make that look a bit more like a real room